Hey guys, I just wanted to show you a quick video here. I picked this uh, TV up. It's a VK106 Motorola. It's got a 10 BP4 in it. Um, of course, I haven't looked at it much except the insides, and but no testing has been done. Well, I just happened to be looking at eBay, and there's a replacement 10 BP4, which is what this takes. Available on eBay. I'll show you the ad here. Here it is there. It's supposed to be tested. Bids 50 bucks. So I'm thinking, well, I better get on the ball and get up my CR70 and test the tube. Well, there's the CR70. And here's the tube. Now I'm using the universal adapter. I was able to test it. I just want to tell you in advance that I wasn't going to make a video. And I'm making a video now because of what I found. I was expecting a picture tube at best to be watchable. You know, really dull, maybe not very good cutoff, that kind of thing. So I hooked up the universal adapter and all the settings and I'll show you what I found. I have it on get this stupid wire out of the way. That's about as good as I can do. Anyways, um, over here it's on filament set. And the filament set is at 1 volt. So let's crank it up to 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. Now I'll adjust the filament set over here. Till it reaches 6.3 volts. Now, as I said, I already ran this test and I wasn't going to make a video, but as you can see, hopefully, there's behind that socket you can see a little bit of a glow, so it's working fine. So, here was the next step I tested for HK shorts. Cool. G1 shorts. Cool again. Cutoff. Now this is where I started getting impressed. I adjusted the cutoff and it went way over this way and way over that way. It's got great cutoff. And now I'm starting to get excited. So we'll put this in the middle where the cutoff is. And we'll test for emissions. Sorry for my shaky hand. My um my arm got swollen up and it I went to the doctors and everything and it's swollen back down but my thumb is completely numb and I'm holding the cam with it and the tip of my fingers are numb so that's why my hand is shaking I have no control over this so bear with me hopefully they can fix it but anyways um so I'll put it on emissions wow well look at that okay now I, I thought I was impressed okay and I was impressed but check this out. I'll do a life test on it. Watch the meter. It's pressed in now. It doesn't budge. About 15 seconds still hasn't budged. Over 20 seconds still hasn't budged. I've had this button in for about almost a minute and it never budged and I'm going oh wait a minute there's something suspicious here maybe this thing isn't working right or testing right so what I did is I went down here to filament voltage and went down to 5 now it should be because I set the filament set at 0.3 it should be probably around 5.3 but you can see at 5.3 it has moved I'm getting suspicious I'm going well, wait a minute something's wrong here 4.3 Still not moved. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe there's something wrong. Three, whoops, 3.3. 3. .3. 3 .3 is just starting to budge. 2.3. We're talking about 2 volts here. Okay, it's going down. The filament is cooling down. You can even see that 
Now I can't even see the brightness anymore because it's cooled down. Now let's turn it back up to three again. Four. Here it's climbing. Four volts. Four volts. That it's almost back where it is, and it's slightly over four volts, five volts, six volts. Okay, it's back to six point three volts. Look at that. This has got to be the best CRT I've ever tested. Even the seven JP4s, I have three of them, um, and. <laughs> they don't test this good. Not at that low voltage, filament voltage. I'm really impressed. So this ought to give a nice bright pitch. It's like brand new. So now, now I'm really excited about working on this TV. I thought you guys might want to see this. And uh, wow, I really like that. So now I don't have to bid for that. Uh, well, the screen saved is gone. But I don't have to bid for that uh, CRT on eBay, obviously. So, um... Now I'm really looking forward to restoring the set. That's about it for this VK106. Sorry, I haven't been making videos. A lot of issues. A lot of issues. Mostly medical. But um, I want to show you this, and then I want to show you then I'm around, and I want to show you this amazing CRT. Here, I'll just end the video. I'll prop the camera on my arm, so hopefully it's a little more steady. I got the life test button pushed in. Look at that. Nothing. Back to cut off. Just to cut off. Helps if I had it on cut off. Got great cut off. And great emissions. That's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope to be making soon some more videos for you. Okay? Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.